So today we speak with Dr. Sean Muir from Amorphix. Uh, pleasure to meet you. Yes, thank you for having me. All right. Uh, so I guess to start, uh, maybe you could tell us a little bit, a bit, uh, little bit about your background. Yeah, so uh, my name's Sean Muir. I'm CTO for Amorphix Incorporated, and uh, my background's in materials chemistry. I got my PhD from Oregon State University in 2012, and then uh, went on to found Amorphix with a couple of colleagues, uh, and uh, we're commercializing amorphous metal thin film electronics um, with broad applications, primarily focused on the display industry right now. Yeah. Um, what, what really drew you here? Was there something specific besides the obvious implications of the technology? Well, I would, in, I would say in some ways uh, the display industry drew us in ah. because when we you know, had that initial look at the foundational technology, mm -hmm. um, we were looking at you know, which markets had you know, issues with you know, switching mm -hmm. and would require a high-speed, low-cost switch. Yeah. Um, fortunately, we benefited that there was a professor there named John Wager mm -hmm. uh, who has a big display industry background. And so uh, that naturally came up for us, um, and uh, we said, "Okay, I think we can, you know, apply this technology there." And so that's why I say, in some ways, the display <laughs> industry drew us yeah. in. Um, okay. So, how about uh, advice specifically for students or, or young engineers who are just trying to get their first job in the display world? Um, as a founder, you're probably on the other side of the, the hiring table. Uh, but is there anything you can tell students uh, about what to expect? Yeah, well, one thing I would say is stop by the job fair here at SID because we have a booth yes. uh, and we are hiring. Um, but uh, aside from that, I would say find your passion um, and put in the time to become an expert. And that, those two things, passion and expertise, mm -hmm. uh, will take you anywhere in the world. It opens so many doors, regardless of whether it's the display industry or yeah. high tech, low tech, mm -hmm. entrepreneurship, uh, you know, volunteer yeah. work. If you can find the passion and you know put in the time to become an expert mm -hmm. in your topic that you're passionate about, I mean, you'll succeed. You will succeed, and yeah. uh, you will draw in what the, the people and the funding yeah. and everything you need to uh, you know, to do what you want to do. do. What you want to do. Cool. Okay. So we'll, we'll finish off by talking a little bit about SID. I think Display Week is, uh, is critical for all of our uh, continued business. Yeah. Um, how has SID membership benefited you outside of, you know, just being the biggest conference in our field? Yeah, yeah. Well, I have a simple word, it's networking. Yeah. Um, if you had to name one thing, it's the networking opportunity. Mm -hmm. um, it's priceless uh, just to get out and see people. Um, more on the, I guess, academic side, it's the resources coming here, seeing the seminars, hearing the talks, uh, you know, you got world-class academic leaders uh, and industry experts down there spouting knowledge. And so just to go in and soak that up is like, yeah, priceless. Thank you.